So up until this point in the series, we've talked about various things you can do with lists. We talked about how to reverse them and also how to sort them. But do you have the skills required to sort it in reverse order? Hmm. Well, if you've been paying attention up to this point, which, I mean, you probably haven't been, but if you were, you probably could figure this out. So why don't you give it a shot? I want these sorted from greatest to least, and I want that outputted in the terminal. Well, I'll show you one solution, and then I'll show you another. So the very first solution would be to sort it, and then reverse it. So we could say data.sort, and then data.reverse. Honestly, it's really not that hard. And then we just print data. So hopefully you're able to figure that out. It's not too crazy. And now the largest is on the left and the smallest is on the right. But there's another variation using the sorted function that I wanted to show you. So we can say sorted, pass in data, and another argument, a named argument, is reverse, and it can take either true or false. So obviously we're gonna pass in true here, and this is gonna return a new sorted list so we'll just print that, or if you wanted to, you could assign it to a sorted data and running this, and we get the data from greatest to least. So if you're working with strings, it would be Z to A as opposed to A to Z. You can literally just think of it as however it's sorted normally, and then you just reverse that list. So that is another way to do it, and hopefully not too complicated and that you understand each piece of this. Next up, I want to talk about sorting strings and how to modify the default behavior. Stay tuned.